Welcome to the Social Atmosphere Movement. This video is titled, Cult-like Behavior from the Zeitgeist Movement, which is a follow-up video to Strict Copyright Protection from the Zeitgeist Movement, linked in the description. What is the Social Atmosphere Movement? The Social Atmosphere Movement is basically the open-source version of the Zeitgeist Movement, hence it advocates the Venus Project and a resource-based economy, yet in an open-source fashion. Unfortunately the leader of the Zeitgeist Movement, Peter Joseph, has decided to restrict the spread of the Zeitgeist Movement by giving out copyright strikes to people who want to show support for the Zeitgeist Movement by re-uploading Zeitgeist Movement-related videos. Members of the Zeitgeist Movement have been doing this for years. Yet now, out of nowhere, it's an issue for some reason. Legally Peter Joseph is completely within his right to give out copyright strikes to people re-uploading Zeitgeist Movement videos, yet it is very mean-spirited for a movement which claims to be about peace and love to give out copyright strikes to people on YouTube for actually supporting the Zeitgeist Movement. This is cult-like behavior which you would expect from Scientology to protect a brand, not the Zeitgeist Movement. A detailed explanation of this situation is found in the video, Strict Copyright Protection from the Zeitgeist Movement, which is linked in the description. Yet basically, when copyright is taken to an extreme, copyright is completely absurd. Like the ANZ Bank owning the color blue, or Cadbury owning purple, or as the book 1984 by George Orwell warns of, when the character Winston Smith believes 2 plus 2 makes 4 is an objective truth, yet the problem is Big Brother and the party owns 2 plus 2 makes 4, so he is tortured until he believes otherwise. This reality has already allowed any combination to exist, so any piece of art, or technical blueprint, or song, etc., is actually a discovery, not an invention. So copyright is actually plagiarizing God if you will. So the idea behind the social atmosphere movement is it is truly a leaderless movement, where we make open source content which advocates an open source society or resource-based economy. And spreading or mirroring said content is actually encouraged, so it is more likely that people will come across the social atmosphere movement. The social atmosphere movement truly is a decentralized movement, what I thought the zeitgeist movement was. Personally I think Peter Joseph has lost the plot if he believes punching down to small YouTube channels that actually support the idea of a resource-based economy is the right thing to do. It will leave people bitter towards the zeitgeist movement if this is how he treats members of his own movement. Hence my idea of an alternative movement without being bound by copyright or gentle machine productions, the social atmosphere movement. Thank you for your time. The following is the Social Atmosphere Movement theme song.